गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू द इंग्लिश ग्रामर क्लास वी आर गोइंग टू रीड एडजेक्टिवस एंड द डिग्रीज ऑफ कंपेरिजन लेट एस सी वॉट इट इज एन एडजेक्टिव ऑफ क्वालिटी चेंजेस इट्स फॉर्म वेन इट इज यूज टू कंपेयर वन नाउन विद अनदर इन अ सेंटेंस दिस इज कॉल्ड द डिग्री ऑफ कंपेरिजन ऑफ एन एडजेक्टिव देर आर थ्री डिग्रीज ऑफ कंपेरिजन द पॉजिटिव डिग्री द कंपेरेटिव डिग्री एंड द सुपरलेटिव डिग्री लेट इज डिस्कस द पॉजिटिव डिग्री फर्स्ट इट इज यूज टू रेफर टू वन ऑब्जेक्ट पर्सन और प्लेस विदाउट एनी कंपेरिजन फॉर एग्जाम्पल ही इज अ टॉल बॉय इन दिस सेंटेंस टॉल इज द पॉजिटिव डिग्री ऑफ एडजेक्टिव बिकॉज इट रेफर्स टू वन ऑब्जेक्ट एंड हैज नो कंपेरिजन विद अनदर ऑब्जेक्ट पर्सन और प्लेस इन अ सेंटेंस द कंपेरेटिव डिग्री इट रेफर्स to a greater degree of adjective as compared to the positive degree it is used when one object in a sentence is compared with another for example he is taller than ram in this sentence taller is the comparative degree of adjective because two objects are compared the superlative degree it refers to the greatest degree of adjective it is used to compare more than two objects people and places for example he is the tallest among his friends in this sentence tallest is the superlative degree because many are compared here let us see the rules for changing positive into comparative and superlative the first rule we add er and est to most one or two syllable words that end in a consonant for example great great is a one syllable word that ends in a consonant to change it into comparative and superlative we add er and est so it has become greater and greatest the second rule when the words end in e we add only r and st to the word let us see the example the word nice ends in e and to make it into comparative and superlative we have added r and st to the word so it has become nice nicer nicest the next rule when the positive ends in consonant plus y we drop the y and add ier and iest now look at the example here the word happy ends in consonant p and y all these words to change it into comparative form we drop the y so in the comparative we drop the y and added i e r to make it happier and in superlative we drop the y and added i e s t so from happy it turns to happier happiest the next rule when the positive is a word of only one syllable that ends in vowel and a consonant we double the ending consonant and then add er and est now look at the example the word red ends with vowel e plus the consonant d to change it into comparative and superlative forms we have to double the ending consonant so the letter d will be doubled we have already doubled here in comparative 
it has become r e double d e r so we have doubled the letter d and added e r to form comparative degree and to form superlative we have doubled the letter d and added e s t so it has become like red redder reddest the next rule when the positive is long that is a word of two or more syllables we add more or most before the adjective now suppose the word in the positive degree is long word and it has two or more syllables to change it into comparative and superlative forms we add more and most respectively so here look at the example beautiful to change it into comparative we have added more and to change it into superlative we have added most so it has become beautiful more beautiful most beautiful next rule some adjectives do not form the comparatives or superlatives from their positives they have irregular degrees of comparison for example good now see here there are adjectives which do not form the comparative or superlative from their positive words from their positive forms like here good is converted to comparative as better and then to superlative as best there is no relation of better and best with the good with the word good it is not formed from the word good rather it changes its forms totally so they have irregular degrees of comparison they have no relation to the word to the word in positive to change it to its comparative and superlative the most important is we use than with a comparative degree and use the with a superlative degree for example shagufta is more intelligent than tanya here more intelligent is a comparative degree of adjective and to write the comparative degree of adjective we always use the word than whenever we compare two objects we always use than with the comparative degree of adjective the next example is mr gupta is the richest man in the town now in this sentence richest is the superlative degree of adjective and to write the superlative degree of adjectives it is compulsory to add the article the before the superlative degree of adjective that's why in the sentence it is written mr gupta is the richest man in the town so the is always added with superlative degree and than is always added with comparative degree i hope the topic is clear thank you children